So, people, I am back with another Death Stole video, and today, guys, we're going to talk about why I may just return for the Witch Queen. Now, I've been putting it off, thinking about it. I'm like, shall I play? I haven't played Destiny in such a while. I'm so far behind. I just don't know. But today, we're going to talk about why I just may return for the Witch Queen. How's it going, guys? My name is DPJ, and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Now, look, I got bits all over me. You know what it is? I got a, a hoodie for Christmas. You know, you don't wash it, you just pull it straight on and on top of your t shirt. I took it off, and now I've got bits all over me, man. Fucking doing my head in. Uh, but yes, people, the Witch Queen uh, comes out. Is it 22nd of February? I mean, this is off the top of my head, 22nd of February. Let me just quickly check back on that screen. Yes, it's the 22nd of February. And to be honest, it looks good. We know it's going to be a big, big DLC. There's going to be a lot of content there. For me, even after having quite a break from Desto, I mean, I think I played last season. This season now, I think I'm like a level four on the season pass. The season before that, before that, and before... I didn't play since the Water Glass. Literally, I didn't play since before the Water Glass came. And I just jumped back on uh, the start of this season. I'm just like, I'm so far behind. My power level is like 13, 21 tops, people. Tops. I mean, I just don't get... The, the whole game's changed since I last played it. I mean, all the mods, the weapon, the rolls. I'm looking at weapons and thinking, what the hell is that That mod there? I've never seen that in my life. And it's just all overwhelming. It just put me off even further. And to make things worse, I tried playing with the, the 30th anniversary event, but it just all felt the same. It felt the same. They added new shit, but to me, it still just felt like the same old shit. Yes, it was new, but it felt like the same old shit. Looking at the Witch Queen, what it's bringing, the enemies play barraging and arc strider and all that kind of shit. It got me intrigued, but I'm still sitting here thinking, well, I'm still only a 13, 21. I'm, I'm coming back. I'm going to be so far behind. Even if I played now up until the Witch Queen, I'd still be. I'd have to put in quite a grind to get my level up that high. And like, I just can't. I, mean, I might just pass. I mean, we got dying light 2 we've got tiny tina's we've got quite a few games coming i mean i can always throw destiny 2 into there uh but i was like i just don't know i don't know but then bongo released a twab last night and let's skip to the scene on my obs we can see here yeah, this is the start of it my well, scroll down a little bit and we can see the power is yours motherfuckers forget all this crap i'm not interested in none of this rubbish I'm interested in this right here. Let me just zoom in a bit so you can all see that shit. Starting on February 22nd, the power floor will be updated to 1350. Any player who signs in will be at appropriate power levels to start the Witch Queen campaign. Even if they've taken a recent break from the game. That includes motherfuckers like me. Now, don't get it twisted. Me and Bungie don't see eye to eye on many, many things. But this is a great, great call for players like me who feel a little overwhelmed jumping back into the game after taking a break. Thinking, oh, my levels are just too low. And this, that, and the other. I guess I understand. It's, it sucks for people who've put in that grind now. The people who've played the game constantly day in, day out. I guess the only advantage you guys have are the better rolled weapons and all the weapons that I have definitely missed, which is fair enough. I reckon Bungie should definitely uh, reward players who have grinded, considering, uh, and leave people out like me who have taken a break. I mean, because if it's the, the rolls reversed, that's what I'd expect. I'd expect this motherfucker took three years break and he's coming back and he's basically on par with me. That ain't fair, Bongo. So I understand that point. And like I said, if that was me and I was 13, 60, 13, 50 and above right now, playing the game every single day, got all the best old weapons. And these bitches come in with the Witch Queen who ain't played in years of on par with me and they ain't done shit. I'd be pretty upset. But you could be just like, I don't 
care. It's fair enough. I mean, Bungie needs to bring players back. because It's quite clear now. A lot of people have taken a break from the game, uh, including me. And a lot of people who follow me have done the exact same thing, which you can't blame them because it is. I mean, it's a grind. It's a bungee. Desto is a lifestyle, people. Desto is a lifestyle. You have to dedicate your ass to the game. And it's something a lot of people can't play due to in real life problems like work and school and shit like that me personally i work from home gaming i ain't got that excuse but i'm talking for the other people here but even still i think that's a great great thing and like i said it definitely i'm sitting here thinking now i'm playing witch queen i'm playing witch queen 100 will i cover it like i used to cover death Star before probably not i'll probably cover it here and there depends how much i like it I mean, I've got a little bit. I'm still going to jump on now. I mean, like I'm saying, I'm seeing this shit here. And I'm thinking, you know what? I might as well jump on the game now and try and get some of these weapons. It don't matter about their levels because once I get, get on a Witch Queen and I'm 1350, that, sh that means the blues and shit are going to drop for me 1350. I can infuse these weapons up that I jump on now and grind for. Or this armor. Got good rolls and shit. So it, 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 I'm sitting there thinking now. We've got what? What's the date today? I don't even know what the fuck is the date today. The 20, so we've got basically a month of, of me playing, getting the weapons, getting what I want, getting those perfect total roll weapons and just sitting on them. And that's what I'm, that's what I'm thinking. I ain't got much to play at the minute. I'm playing Call of, I'm playing fucking Call of Duty, people. That's how, that's how hard times are. Gaming wise, it's just nothing for me to play. And although actually I'm enjoying Call of Duty, dare I say it the first time in utter years, I'm enjoying Call of Duty. But paper, it seems as though. Uh, I was going to call it Beyond Light then. What is it? Witch Queen? Witch Queen. It may have just brought me back. Now, I can't say how long I'm going to last playing it. But I think it could be quite good. I think it could be quite good. But we will say, paper. We will see. You know, I didn't, you know, I jumped on Twitter today. And so Palamine, he's now talking about this. And I'm like, what's he on about? What is he talking about? So I put out a joke tweet. Where is it here? I'll show it you. Where is this joke ass tweet I put out? I'm like, I'm just messing around. Like, is Bungie resetting everyone's power level at 1350 for Witch Queen? Does that include mine, which is currently 1320? And I've got people writing, I believe so, yeah. And I'm like, what? really? I was joking. I was joking. The legendary joker said the same thing. I, I was joking, people. So yeah, this is good news in my opinion. This is good news. I mean, I'll, I'll read through the rest of this shit. I don't even know. I don't even know. I haven't read a twat. I mean, look at this shit. What is this? Arc Analyzer. Void Analyzer. Omni Telemetry. Banshee Special. What is that? Banshee Special. Sounds quite sexual if I'm honest. <laughs> But yeah, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. I'm going to have to jump on and learn. I ain't even done the new dungeon, people. I don't even have a Hawk Moon Catalyst or a Dead Man's Tail Catalyst. Are they even a thing? Is No Land Beyond back yet? Where the fuck is a No Land Beyond? I mean, like I'm saying, I just don't know what's going down here. I don't know what's going down here. And I've missed so many exotics, I'm guessing as well. Ah, oh, people. People. But yes, guys, yes, yes, yes. I thought I'd make a quick video updating people on where I stand with Destiny. I don't think I've done one where I've spoke about uh, Witch Queen and if I'm coming back to play it or not. I know a lot of people have asked that question, but yeah, I think I might. I think I just might. Thanks to this right here. Where'd it go? That there. So yeah, I mean, I'm gonna save that shit. That's a good picture. Oh, it's a bit shit quality. Forget that. Forget that shit. But yes, people, there we have it. Uh, guys, if you enjoyed the video and want to see more Death Star from me, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next.